Hey, what's going on guys? It's No Shoes and we're back with another one and today we're going to be reacting to Even Shadows Have Shadows from Idea. This was suggested by Ishmael Gademsi. If I pronounced that wrong, let me know in the comments down below, but thank you Ishmael for the suggestion. Keep the suggestions coming in and check out the link to the No Shoes Gang Discord server in the description below. But let's get right into this, see what Idea has to say, see what this is all about. Even Shadows Have Shadows. Let's get it. All right. So we got the intro just kind of swelling in. I know it said just to listen, but I couldn't listen to it. Ooh, that's an interesting switch right there. I wasn't expecting that. Let's bring it back a little bit. I stand alone, burned every bridge over the troubled water. No longer hiding from my personality disorder. A stronger tide is coming. I've been running, trying to function fine without my mind climbing up this fucking order. I was okay. Interesting little flow coming in. Sounded kind of chaotic and almost disorganized at the beginning, but seems artistic in that way and i feel like it's about to kind of start lining up a little bit more here after these you know the like first four bars coming in let's hear it though Ooh, this flow is crazy it's real bouncy kind of taking me back and forth a little bit He's talking a lot just about, you know, what's going on in his mind first in this first section here. Hold up. Here we go. Burned every bridge over the troubled water. No longer hiding from my personality disorder. He's no longer hiding from what's going on inside his head. Starting to deal with it. And, um, you know, trying to function fine without his mind. Climbing out of this corner. I guess, you know, climbing out of that corner that you've been backed into up against the wall, maybe by his personality disorder. And then let's see, where does it go from here? It's interesting how these pages are like peeling back. And then, you know, we're coming in, starts talking about soul, my soul to the devil, all this kind of stuff. But let's keep it going. I don't want to talk about it too much before he ex he gets to explain. Got in rebel crap in the absence of heaven, heavy hands and develop an evident level of benevolence. So it's probably better I sell my soul to the devil. This is a message to anyone I met that thinks they know me. Don't pretend to understand any of the issues that I'm holding. Okay. To rush okay. Through, I'm up, look, mom, no cuts, just a stomach of disgust and the fear that I might go nuts this year. If I don't Ooh. blow up, I'll see you on my way. One day this shit'll kill me, but I guess that it's okay. This time I've lost all faith in a world so full of hate, and I don't fucking love music. I just use it to escape. Away. Ooh. Now that's a crazy bar, you know, he's uh, he's lost all faith in a world so full of hate, you know, saying one day this shit will kill me, but he guess it's okay, but what hits me for is when he goes, I don't love music, I just use it to escape. Now that's real interesting, man, I know a lot of us use music as a way to, you know, music can help us with like our emotions, with how we feel and just let us escape for a minute. But I find it interesting that it really made that point to say, I don't love the music, it's just my escape. Very interesting. Let's keep it going. In a world so full of hate, and I don't fucking love music, I just use it to escape. Like it. Walk between you, wanted to punch someone in the face. And put in a bullet in my head to leave the human race. Ooh. But there's no toes I can take. I haven't yet found a good reason to pick your ways in a career. Okay, everything takes its toll, but there's no tolls I can take. Interesting. So everything's taken from him, but there's nothing he can take back. Interesting little point to make in there. Let's keep it going. No toes I can take. I haven't yet found a good reason to pick your ways in a corroded bones I have behind my smile. I'm angry at the universe for the way she treats me now. It keeps me down. Stealing all my energy. Feeling like my enemy. Concealing my identity. Not dealing okay. with my tendencies. I feel the skin and then I squeeze her in the prison. He's not ill in this century. I'm kneeling to the entity who built this penitentiary. It's Oh, this scheme is just 
He just keeps pushing, 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 bop, 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 just rhyme after rhyme after rhyme. The spin's real interesting in this. I really like his flows. The cadence is nice. And um, the bars are quick, but they got enough in them to keep, you know, to, to actually say something. But let's keep it going. This is fire. Ooh, oh man, so don't, so first of all he's saying in 10 years don't check for me, I'll be in the same place, he'll be right there, we just gotta come back where we left him man, we ain't even gotta look around, and then just saying this planet's an overpopulated mental hospital, each zombie walk around constitutes another obstacle, what I'm starting to see right now, and let me know what you guys think in the comments, is I think he's talking about pharmaceuticals and uh, you know the drugs that so many people take to keep themselves feeling sane. You know whether it's uh, Adderall or Xanax or whatever substance it is that's keeping these people sane. He's basically saying you know it's turning them into zombies. That's what I'm getting from this. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. But let's keep it going. Mental hospital, least I'll be walking around constitutes another obstacle. So here it is. I'm finally coming out my shell. All 19 years of my life have been in conflict with myself. I'm insecure about every facet of my existence. From my addictions to the condition I choose to live in. I'm insecure about every facet of my existence from my addictions to the conditions I choose to live in. That's a nice bar right there. Really just just being so open with us about what's going on in his head, how he sees everything. I'll always love that. Y'all know that already. Let's keep it moving. This is from my addiction to the condition I choose to live in. Who you kidding? I took from excess anxiety, a product of pollution in American society. Staring okay. to my eyes and see the hell that burns inside my mind. And I no longer have an ego I can hide behind. But I'm in okay. Interesting. Stare into my eyes, see the hell that burns inside my mind, and I have no I no longer have an ego that I can hide behind. So the ego's gone, it's just him. You know, what do we even call him without the ego? Is idea the name from the ego? Who knows? But he ain't that anymore. He's something else. Let's keep it going. And I no longer have an ego I can hide behind. But I've been quiet, disregarded by insanity. Every form of art isolates from humanity, but it's revolting against the enforced mental thought education for a decade and three years. A headache for my fears. Now I realize I could have learned more on my own. They taught me how to know everything except my soul, which is everything. Ooh. Interesting. They taught me how to know everything except my soul. I know a lot of us in that you know especially going going through public school and everything we can really relate man they taught you just about everything they could besides stuff that was actually important we know how to do math but not taxes we know how to i don't even know we learned about anatomy and stuff but they don't teach you how to fix anything you know like so much stuff and then teaching you about your soul they teach they just always teach you like oh you gotta go to college you gotta do this that and the other you're gonna graduate from school you get a job with your degree or diploma whatever it is that you're doing now don't even teach you how to know what you want to do how to know who you are how to be a person that you enjoy being facts let's keep it going I now I realized I could have learned more from my own they taught me how to know everything except my soul which is everything I Ooh, now that's a nice one. So, two things I want to say is, first of all, this beat's crazy. I love the way the beat's melding with the song. And it's really adding an extra layer of just tone to all the bars with just, I don't know, it sounds chaotic but organized. I can't really put my finger on it, but it just really reminds me of like what might it might feel like is going on in somebody's head that's having some disorganized, just not necessarily controlled thoughts. And then, um, you know, him saying, whether it's 10 feet or 100 feet, you're still bound by chains. Whether you can walk to walk out the front door of the house or you can walk to the gas station, you still 
He's still chained up and can't get out. That's really interesting. Almost like we're all prisoners inside, you know, this world around us. But let's keep it going. Ten feet are up, feet, the back remains the same. You still bond by chains. Some people say I've changed and it's harder to relate to me. Good, I never liked you. Our friendship was make believe. Ooh. I like that. Harder to relate to me. Friendship was make believe. That's a nice bar right there. Harder to relate to me. Good, I never liked you. Our friendship was make believe. Uh, feeling the mass back in. Feeling the rap that's been. Feeling my organs. Feeling short distorted portions. The more it that gets it tortured. And unfortunately, crafted an interest to orbit my portion. And inflict my image with disorder. The minutes get shorter. The walls start to close in. Feels like the brain is hanging on by one close in. I've hidden Ooh. in the darkness for too long. I make it look alright when I'm the inside. It's all wrong. I want life to change, but I don't know if it can for a man or machine or whatever. Ooh, man, you know, this is the music of somebody who's deeply frustrated and just trying to understand what's going on, trying to understand their place, trying to understand who they are, trying to understand, you know, just this world around them and come to terms with reality, you know, for a man or machine or whatever the fuck I am. That's, you know, that seems like a really powerful bar to me, and I really like the feel of that in... This whole song is crazy, you know, talking, feels like brain is hanging on by one clothespin, hidden in the darkness for too long, I make it look all right on the inside, I'll look all right, but on the inside it's all wrong, you know, this sounds a lot like stuff that, you know, people with, uh, you know, we talk about with people like Robin Williams and Anthony Bourdain and stuff when they pass away, and it's, uh, you know, it always comes back to, that like cliche quote of you know sometimes the people who are the happiest are the ones who need the hope most helper the ones who appear the happiest at least but um let's keep it going i like this a lot i make it look all right when i'm the inside it's all wrong i want life to change but i don't know if it can for a man or machine or whatever the fuck i am i stand alone burned every bridge over the troubled water no longer hiding from my personality disorder you want to die my life will come and stay in madness his favorite little corner because even shadows have shadows and my secrets are eating me eagerly fading and scream hey and then we get the title of the song even shadows have shadows i like it you know Basically, I feel like that's saying even the darkness in your own mind gonna cast a shadow on something. Very interesting. That was fire. I really like that. That was a crazy song. I'm wondering, are these still, is this still the song? Hold up. Looks like we got some more bars coming in. It looks like a mouthful. Okay, are these just words? I guess I'll just read them to us because I'm curious. You can't talk about idea without mentioning the HBO aired Blaze Battle. As a kid whose appearance makes it easy for every competitor to find material and punchlines, it still was the rhyme sayer kid that took home the title and he destroyed it too. And then the word started to spread. Puffy offered him a deal, lots of money, cars, and an apartment in NYC. So if you were idea, you'd be wearing shiny suits now and do the post mace dance. You'd just have graced the cover of the source and you have looked awfully out of place. You'd have sold, let's see, is there more left? I'm curious. Is this just like them talking about idea's story? I guess we'll find out. I gotta know what the rest of this say. Are they going to add any more? There we go. You'd have sold out. You'd be sold out. Okay, so now they're adding like little... Oh, this is a quote from a magazine. All right, so this is from Urban Smart Magazine. You'd be sold out with an O-L-D and an O-U-L-E-D 
and laughed about, but according to the legend, Idea turned the offer down for good reasons. It seems as with abilities and the rhyme Sayer Collective, Idea already has a producer and family, and while the Idea, uh, this seems like a bunch of nonsense, seems pretty cool story about Idea, but I'll read it on my own time or something. I'm not too worried about it. That was Even Shadows Have Shadows from idea this was suggested by ishmael so thank you ishmael for the suggestion keep the suggestions coming in in the comments down below guys i really do appreciate them hit that like button if you enjoyed the video hit subscribe if you want to see more videos like this hit that bell so you can get notified every time i drop a new video take a look in the description down below where you'll find links to the no shoes gang merch as well as my affiliate links if you grab something from there you'll be supporting me directly so i really do appreciate it and thank you to everybody in the no shoes gang everybody watching these videos and i will see you guys next time.